know, it's exciting. Uh, have fun. How do you describe your game? Um, just active, you know, uh, offensive rebounding, defending, you know, those are things that I do. That's my job on the court. And uh, just man, doing whatever I can to help the team win. What you compare yourself to? Um, I would look at Tristan Thompson, definitely as a guy, you know, just his motor and how hard he works. Another guy, Kenneth Reed, you know, him just working hard, just making sure he outworks everybody on the court at every, any given second. How much did your success at the combine uh, help your confidence come to these workouts? Uh, I helped out a lot, you know, just getting the opportunity finally to compete with all those guys from around the country and just kind of trying to show the world that I can that I can play and that I belong here and um, getting the opportunity to work out, you know, it's been great. Have you had that little chip? Oh, most definitely, most definitely, angry. most yeah. definitely. You know, just got to work. Feel like I got to work a little bit harder than everybody else. You know, just every opportunity that I got, got to seize it. So. What are you hearing about the NBA draft boards and, and where you might land? Um, I've heard a lot. You know, honestly, you know, I try to just keep working hard to improve it, keep getting my stock higher and higher. But uh, it's been a lot. Just want to keep my head level and keep working. Do you have a personal goal or where you think you would like to land? Uh, first round, most definitely. That's my goal. You know, coming from my unknown school, you know, from getting to the undrafted board, you know, now to working my way on the radar and just trying to keep working up the best way I can. What's the thing you got to show over the next few weeks to these coaches and GMs? Um, just show that I, that I belong, you know, that I'm, I'm going to outwork everybody that I step on the court with, you know, and um, I had a talent to be here. When you were at the Combine, how did you feel like you matched up together, guys? I feel like I matched up well. I was able to show some of my strengths, you know, my motor, my defensive abilities, and I think that definitely helped out. If I were to maybe go back and ask your teammates how to describe you as a teammate, what do you think they'd say about you? Uh, just a great teammate. You know, did what I could to help the team win and always put the team before myself. Whatever I have to do for the team to be successful, that's what I'm going to do with no hesitation. Having been your conference's defensive player of the year, what about your defense really stands out in your opinion? Um, just my shot blocking. You know, uh, a lot of times I, I take really I take a lot of pride in being the last line of defense, and um, I don't want anybody scoring at the rim. You know, to just put it in uh, regular words, you know, I don't want anybody scoring at the rim, especially on me. So I want to be that guy my team can depend on. You didn't hit threes your first year, second year, thirty percent, up to forty-two percent this last year. Is that something that you've really worked on? And yes, sir. On? Most definitely, just improving my jump shot to. Have another threat on the court, you know, just make it tougher for the defense to defend me and my team and uh, be able to knock down that shot. You know, it's just a it's a great thing for the team. So you see yourself as a stretch forward? Most definitely. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. What was the process that kind of went into evolving into that kind of player? Uh, to be honest, it was just work, you know, just concentrating on getting up hundreds, thousands of shots a day. My coaches at Bowling Green really pushed me to become a better shooter and just being able to knock down that shot. You know, I had to put in hours in the gym. You've had recently and coming up? Um, worked out with the Clippers, actually. You know, so I've been in LA for a while. Uh, got a few more. I don't want to quote any wrong, so I have to talk to my agent about it. But it's, <laughs> it's definitely a few more, yes, sir. You, could you see yourself here in LA? Most definitely. It's a beautiful city, you know. Most definitely, you know. Uh, coach Byron Scott, great coach. Would love to play for him, so I could I could definitely see myself here. Have you got any advice from Rob Sacre? Oh, uh, yeah, uh, Rob, we actually had the same agent. Yeah. You know, uh, he talks about him all the time. I haven't got a chance to talk to him, meet him, but just his journey, you know, is something I can I can definitely look up to. Rob's a character. Yes, what is the fact that you played all four years? What do you think I can go and play? Um, just experience, you know, from being on the court, understanding how to play with uh, different guys of that sort. So I definitely think, you know, just the feel for the game playing all four years is definitely something I can take advantage of.